All right, let's get going. Oh yeah, we gotta fix the penguin. We always do. But we got the snowman up. And we got some lights on the railing. Yeah. All right, come on, let's get going. Come on, I think I hear the bus coming. What you got? Snow. Snow? Yeah. All right. Let's see it. Let's see it explode. Oh, so good. <laughs> Did you get it all? Yeah. <laughs> I'm a stilt bug. Where are we going? To daycare. Shall we? Let's show. Good morning. Happy Monday. Hard to believe it is already the last Monday before Christmas. Um, I am heading home after dropping off Tilda. It's going to be a busy week since I am off next week. I've got, you know, all of my loose ends to tie up um, in order to be out for a week. So that'll be fun. Um, <laughs> But, uh, and on top of that, any spare moment that I have is going to be spent on Chris finishing Christmas stockings to get those done in time. Um, yeah, it's going to, it's looking to shape up to be a busy week. And, uh, full co confession, I have not done that much Christmas shopping or, until yesterday. Um, I'm a big believer in online shopping and prime shipping anyway, but <laughs> yeah, I did most of my Christmas shopping yesterday online. Um, so I'll have those things to arrive and wrap and prepare and so it's going to be a busy Christmas. So we've got, um, we do Christmas with my extended, not my, well yeah, my extended family, uh, my immediate family and Greg's immediate family, um, and then of course our own little Christmas. So right now it's looking like Friday night is going to be my family, which we call the very Perry Christmas, um, because I'm a Perry, uh, by birth. So, <laughs> so very, very Perry Christmas is going to be Friday night, and then we're going to do our, our own Christmas on Saturday morning, um, and then we're going to do uh, uh, Greg's family Christmas on Saturday afternoon, and then Sunday, um, Christmas Eve, that's when we do our big uh, family celebration um, in my family. So, we drive down to Virginia um, and go to my grandma's house. Um, she's in Purcellville, living on the, the side of a mountain there. Um, so we'll be down there for Christmas Eve, and then we'll spend the night, um, open up stockings in the morning. We're going to stay the whole day, probably. I still have to email my grandma and check. Um, <laughs> but we'll stay the whole day, Christmas Day, uh, and head home Tuesday morning. So it's a very busy um, Christmas celebration series really <laughs> every year <laughs> so it'll be a lot of fun and then the week after Christmas we've got New Year's and um, it's becoming tradition to host that at my house um, so we get together with my immediate family and play games and eat food and watch the ball drop and then hopefully go out for breakfast the next morning so um, it should be a lot of fun gearing up for the uh, remainder of the holiday season so anyway I'm gonna get back to work get started on the busyness because uh, it's pretty much going to be non-stop until next Tuesday. So. <laughs> So I am on my lunch break. Um, I grabbed another really just quick, easy lunch um, because I need to spend every moment of my lunch break um, knitting. Um, I am working from the couch today because it's just that kind of a day. Sometimes it just is. Sometimes you just, you don't feel like sitting in the office chair in the office surrounded by non-comfy things. So, <laughs> so today is a sit comfy 
um, and keep the brain on uh, work mode though. So I am doing a ton of documentation today, um, a big year end push. So fortunately that only requires one screen anyway, cause I gotta take everything that I know how it works in my brain and get it down on paper and hope it makes sense to other people cause <laughs> that's the challenging part. But anyway, so good, um, good couch work to do. Sorry, it's wiggling cause I'm resting my camera on my laptop screen. <laughs> So anyway, um, so I have a ton of knitting to do. I am working on another stocking. So I finished the first one last night. Um, this is the second one that I was working pretty much in tandem. So it was already mostly done. Um, so I'm working on the foot now. Um, and then I've just got to do the toe and seam it up. Um, and then it needs the same finishing touches as the first one. Um, and then I've got the third stocking to do, which I haven't even started yet. Um, but I only have two sets of the needles that I need so I could only do two at a time anyway um, so I may I think I'll finish this one first before I start the third one I don't, I don't really feel like um, doing them in tandem at the moment so that's the knitting I'm working on um, tonight um, I did think of something that we'll be doing <laughs> um, so as I mentioned for New Year's um, my whole family is going to be coming over to our house um, and everyone's gonna be spending the night so um, we need to clean the house um with everyone spending the night all the rooms are going to be in use so we need to clean all the rooms instead of just the ones that we live in um so we've got that to do and rather than spending all week next week focusing on that i'm hoping to just get it done a little bit at a time this week and enjoy having off next week and maybe do things with the kids and such um i may actually extend vlogmas through the end of december i haven't really decided yet um, but we do have a lot of fun stuff that we're planning to do, so I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, that was all a bit rambly. Um, so I'm going to drink my lunch. Um, I'm watching a bunch of vlogs, Vlogmas videos that I have fallen back on um, that I'm, you know, catching back up. And uh, yeah, then it'll be back to work and then uh, hopefully a productive afternoon into a productive evening. Well, it was a productive lunch because I'm only about an inch away. Now I need to get the length of the foot to seven and a half inches. So yeah, so back to work. I'll get back to this later. So oh, I belong to a really awesome Facebook mommy group that I love. Um, and we have done a, a Christmas exchange the last couple of years. And so my exchange person um, said that she knew somebody who did yarn. Um, <laughs> so I know at least one thing that's in here, but my, um, my secret Santa has arrived, so I'm gonna open it now. <gasps> oh my goodness. Wow, she, she went all out. There's a shoe and a scooter and a penny farthing and a suitcase and some palm a palm tree oh two palm trees wow she did good <laughs> my goodness um there's a coat cap a hot air balloon a camera a little uh, champagne glass and a boat. So it looks like this is from High Strung Spectra. So there's the there's the information. Very cool. I'm so excited. Oh, look at that. That's beautiful. Hope I can get that to focus. Look at that. Gorgeous. Honestly, I was just expecting the yarn. Second, there's another little one there. This is beautiful. So it's Leah Willis. This is her friend, um, my secret Santa's friend. So Leah Willis, high, spung, high, <laughs> high strung spectra. So she's got an Etsy shop. Hand painted and kettle dyed, yarn and roving, hand spun yarn and hand designed stitch markers. That is amazing. So not only did I get an incredible gift, but um, I have a new maker now. I, I found out about a new one that I can tell you guys about too. Oh, this is great yarn though. This is really cool. I think it's a DK, 
No, it's fingering. Wow, it is really squishy. I totally thought it was DK. Um, merino nylon. Called Emerald Isle. Ah, I'm so excited! 